Hello, everybody, and welcome to Feeding Girl Fetch. You yet again, we're back, and we'll be continuing on the great map. Easy mode. I'll go through all the fish again at some point. Uh, on medium and hard mode, on every map, so we can get every experience. But uh, I just want to remind you, just like in the last video, uh, episode three. I told you about the 25 views on one feeding girl fish video by episode seven by episode before episode eight is filmed. We need to have so like this is what we're gonna do today the cuttlefish. Uh, tomorrow you'll see the mahi mahi, then the green moray, then the anglerfish. Then I'll wait a couple of days, and if we don't have 25 views on any of the videos, even the first one, we're we're just gonna skip the black tip shark and go on to the next area. And trust me, even if you don't like the black tip shark, there's a lot of other stuff that's gonna be really cool down the line. So if you want to see any of that, 25 views is what we need. So um, I've been told that they have abilities. I did wasn't aware of. So hypnosis. If the cuttlefish does not move before attacking, it begins to rapidly alter its skin color, causing a potential prey to look at it. Active ink burst releases ink from ink sac in order to confuse predator and escape. Okay, this will be interesting. Well, let's go right ahead. I'm not sure if this is going to be a hard creature to use or or what. But we are very tiny. And I mean very small. Oh yeah, we are so very small. There are starfish here, so... Oh god, Mahi Mahis. Oh god, this is terrible. Mahi Mahis are just like... They'll attack... Like, so much stuff in the beginning. Like, even shark in the beginning of, like... Oh! I'm being attacked. Something's chasing me. I got the message. Oh, uh, it's a mantis shrimp. Crap. That's not good. Here, we can eat this one. All right, level two, perfect. We're a little bigger now. Another starfish, all right. I'm gonna see if I can get back to my turtle spot, because that is like the best place. Oh, God. What killed me? What, what was that? What killed me? It was so fast. All right, well, I guess we'll respawn, I suppose. Can I eat this fish? I'm trying. I do 0.8 damage, which for the first level isn't too terrible. Oh, I can actually kill this fish. As you saw in the last video, I was a little disappointed by the last creature. It wasn't as good as I had hoped. Ooh, I'm not, I'm not he's... Oh, I'm good, thanks. There's a lot of these little pink fish. But what we want is my turtle area. Because that is the best place to farm on the map. That's what I think. Could be wrong, but I think it's the best spot. Like, if you guys know a better spot, let me know, but I, I think it's really good. Because turtles are really easy to kill, even at low-level creatures. Like, obviously you need a creature that can do some damage, but... They can't hit you, so it's like, what are you worried about? As long as you have time, you know, there's nothing you need to worry about. So, we need a war car. I don't know exactly where I am. Like, I don't know where this thing spawns anyway. I, but I think this is about the area I want it to be in. 
it's got tons of these little, like, I don't know, what they're, like, starfish, corals or something. Tell me what these other pink things are. Like, not the starfish, but, like, what I just ate a minute ago. Like, what, is, what are those? Like, what are they supposed to be? Are they, like, another kind of, like, starfish type thing? Or are they, like, a coral? I don't know. But I'd like to know. But, uh, I don't know if I mentioned this, but I... Is it... Is it kind of just cephalopod? Because I really like cephalopods. Like, squid, um, octopi, you know, all of those things. I, I just think they're so cool. And this guy just... His little face reminds me so much of him. What is that? Oh my god, it's like typey me! That's awesome! I don't know if you saw the last uh, two videos, I think. I ate a baby cuttlefish in both of them. The first, the second, the first time I did it, I don't think I said anything, but the same time I was like, I ate another baby cuttlefish. So should we make it a, should we make it a, <laughs> should we eat another baby cuttlefish as the cuttlefish? I don't know. But it does seem like we've made our money back, so this creature is definitely useful. Oh, yep, there's the turtle. Hiya. I did 2.3 damage, that's not terrible. Like, I could do a lot more damage, like, you know, like, the violet doing like, 4 damage on, it's like a lot better. Remember when we are kind of freaking out and trying to kill this turtle? I like, killed so many of them. Because, you know, if you've seen the last videos, you know this is my favorite spot. There's one right here, they all just stop. It's like handscaping. Like, I can't even see myself right now. I'm just gone. I, I am the turtle. And the turtle's trying to get away, but he's not getting away. How uh, well, you know, I think we're gonna get maybe level 6 at most. Oh, he got out. No, 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 I don't think so, buddy. You're mine. Your soul belongs to me. Hey, no. 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 Give me your butt. I'm eating your butt. Oh, God. God, I hate how I glitch like inside of the creature. It's kind of funny though. I am literally. Oh, 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 oh. oh. Do I get him, boy? Can I just. I'm doing 2.3 damage, which is really not that bad. Is this the same turtle? Mm hmm. Yeah, so then we finally knocked it out. Oh my god. This thing is so hard to kill. Thanks. Fox is like, what? Thanks. Fox is whacked. I want out of this turtle! Seriously though, it's like... It's even knocked out and I am still not able to kill it. It's like, come on. Die. I know cattlefish aren't known for being vicious, terrifying creatures, but like... Seriously. I just killed a turtle. Dead. Oh, okay. We got it. We got the giant chunk of a piece of meat. Oh no. Please. No. Death. Please. Please. Let me eat you. I want to eat this giant piece of meat. Yes. Yes. Let me eat it. Let me eat it. 
Oh my god, do I have to break these pieces up too? Okay, I can eat all these. Okay, that was level 5. I need level 6. Do I have to buy this again? Oh, yeah, there we go. Yep, I was right just over level 6. What do you guys guess? Were you right? Do you agree with me, or do you think it was something different? I'm just curious, what? After we get through all these creatures, which may be after episode 7, or it could be after episode almost 20, I think. What map do you guys want me to do next? River, swamp, or reef? Or do you guys want me to try crab madness on this map? It's basically like I'm gonna get to play as a crab instead of a fish. Which should be interesting, there's a couple different crabs that we'd spend a little bit of time on it, but we wouldn't, it, would, it would be like a five, four episodes. It wouldn't be a crazy amount, but it would be... I believe that you can do it on this map and the reef map. And, uh, yeah, I think I'll just do crab map madness right after uh, we get through like, this map. If it has crab madness, we'll do that right afterwards. And that goes to several 25 episodes. It's gonna be such a good series. I love this game. And honestly, if you guys are getting a little bit bored of me just sitting here eating around, I wouldn't be terribly mad at you if you. Oh. My mommy, mommy, though. Come on! Oh, oh no! Oh no! Oh no! If I believe you're honest, I cannot wait to play as the Mahi Mai, because that's what I'm gonna do to everyone else. The Mahi Mai is like the most annoying visions game. I hate it. I hate it so much. Oh my god. Alright. Well, um. Should I go one more time? You guys want me to go one more time? I'll go one more time. Why not? Alright, we're in. And we're already dead. I'm already getting the noises that tell me that it's bad news. Bears. Okay, some people were upset that I was playing with the sound off. So I turned my sound on. They wanted me to be aware that I was gonna die, so... Turn my sound on because they wanted me to. I just think it makes it more exciting. Also, the noise is terrifying itself. Like, it just makes you feel like you're in so much danger. Oh, and once again, if you guys want me to revisit a creature, just just tell me. You know, just just let me know. I won't revisit it immediately. I'm probably gonna make a playlist like, uh, Feed and Grow Fish Revisiting or something, or something like that. Also, just let me know if you guys like this idea. I might make a playlist of me, like, trying to beat the bosses, you know, like the Arutima, the Megalodon, the Great White. Uh, Pronathodon, like, oh no. Oh, flip. This Mahi Mahi needs to leave my area, bro. Yeah, if you would like a channel, like, of me just, uh, I mean, a playlist of me just trying to use different features, like, for example, this guy to beat the Megalodon, like, you think he could do it? I think it's gonna beat the Megalodon? I think he could if he was big enough. I think if we got him maybe a level 100, maybe? Yeah, but it'll just be me trying to beat bosses with this little guy and stuff. I don't know. I, I think it'd be fun. But, you know, if you guys don't like that idea, then I guess I won't do it. But I hope you do like the idea, because I want to do it. 
Oh! Apologies for that. I was really curious if I could do a flip. Can I do barrel rolls? No, not really. No barrel rolls, unfortunately. But we can eat a starfish. This game makes you just want to throw up sometimes. You're just like... Just... There are baby Bibos around here, but I'm not so... Yeah, what are these texts? Someone tell me, what is this? It's like a starfish that's like all wrapped up in its, like, arms or whatever. Is that what it is? But it seems so much like solid. I don't know. And also, what are these bones from? Like, these are huge, like, bigger than the Megalodon. I have a theory. This is the newest map on Feed and Grow Fish. The next map is gonna have some kind of... Some creatures that are like, whatever this is. It's gonna have like a Mosasaur or something. It's gonna be terrifying. Or at some point they're gonna add like a sea serpent or something that's not actually real to the game. I don't know. Feed and Grow Fish is gonna go into like every individual creature and like go really in depth. Or is it gonna be like most other games that just goes into like mythical creatures so they can create their own and not actually need facts about the creatures. Honestly, I can see them going in either way. So far, they it seems like they've tried to stay sort of realistic. Like, obviously, a cuttlefish can only get so big. It can't get infinitely big. But, I think it's a fun way of saying that all creatures can be good. So, those tentacles, that's terrifying. Or they appendages, like, is that what they're called? When I was a little kid, I just called them, I just, uh, called them their little face thingies, you know? They're just little face thingies. That's all they are. Yeah, I'd be a lot bigger right now if that Mahi Mahi wasn't around. I've not died of it twice. Maybe a different Mahi Mahi this time. Another starfish. We're getting relatively close. Okay, there's a crab right over there. I don't know if a crab is something I can kill with this. Maybe it is, I don't know. Oh, I should have tried my ink ability on that Mahi Mahi earlier. That would have been smart. That's why I didn't do it. <laughs> See what I did there? It would have been smart, that's why I didn't do it. Also, no fat jokes. You know, last last time th 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 I said no fat jokes, and there's gonna be fat jokes. So and there probably is fat jokes. I haven't looked, but there's probably fat jokes. Flip. You guys reckon I could kill a crab? Like, I'd like to kill the crab. Fuck me. Ow, ow. I'll run if I, if I get too much damage on me. I think I got him. Oh yeah, I did get him. Okay. Well then I think we can take that out. The Bibos, though, are just like... And also, yes, I'm aware. It's Bibos, not Bibo. I just got confused and I titled it wrong. Accept it. I'm sorry. I'm not fixing it. <laughs> Because I don't want all your views to go away, otherwise, you know, you guys might never see a shark, and that wouldn't be fair, would it? Would it? Would it be fair? Oh, no, 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 so we're leaving it. Forever. And also, I don't want to fix it. Derp, 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 derp. Derp, 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 derp. Derpy derp. So this thing just so derpy. Like, <laughs> Wait, let me see. <laughs> so derpy. But, this is the creature I have to play as. Yeah, man, three attempts, honestly. I think this thing is kind of like the last creature. You know, it's cool, but not as I don't know if it's worth the seven points. Like, it made it back, but it made it back out. Ah, oh, starfish. Like, I'm almost, I'm like almost level eight, and I, like, I was like level six, and I couldn't kill the mahi mahi. That's probably level one. 
I think the Mai Mai is our next fish, so episode 5, the Mahi Mahi, I have high hopes for that. I hope we don't die at all. I think that's the next creature that'll actually be good. I'm most excited for that Mora eel. I think you'll all like it. I, I haven't played as it yet, but I want to. And I tried to hold out because uh, I want to get the first experience with all of you as well. So I try not to play just too many creatures without all of you as well. So if I do seem a little underwhelmed, it may be because I've played as it, but I've only played as a couple of other creatures like the tiger shark on reef, as well as the bibos, um, uh, Stingray, and I've played, I think, the Perch, and the, um, Piranha on the river map, that's all I've done. And I tried to play as a crab, but just didn't go well, so I played a tiny bit as a crab, but not much. I think that's everything. Everything else you've seen me play. So I hope uh, not all of you were too upset about that, but uh, can't go back and change it now, can I? No, I cannot. I can't change it now. And also, if you're enjoying the YouTube video, like, subscribe, and want to tell the end. Do you guys ever get frustrated whenever YouTubers just say watch till the end like all the time? You're just like, play the video, I'm gonna watch till the end, but you're the one taking up my time. I understand, but it's just a little reminder. I don't do it often. It's just, you know, small time. Just chill. Remember, 25 years, otherwise, no sharky boys. And I'm gonna have put this challenge in every single time that there's gonna be a shark. I'm just kidding. Like, on every map. On every difficulty. <laughs> I'm gonna give you all a hard time. Oh, and just a warning, I'm not gonna go, like, easy mode on all the creatures, and I'm gonna go medium mode on all the creatures on the exact same map. I'm gonna just go through easy mode every creature on every map, then I'll do it all in medium mode, is my thinking. And if it seems like I'm spending most of my time playing King Grofish, um, I am. I love the game. I hope you all do too. It's just... The videos are doing a lot better than the Planet Zoo ones I've made. I'm gonna try and make more of those, it's just these ones are doing so much better. Like the first one, I posted the Planet Zoo video two days ago, and then the Fingerfish, uh, seven hours ago. The Fingerfish one was already ahead. The evil just think it's more funny. Which I can understand, Planet Zoo is a, a choir taste. It's an interesting game. I, I very much like it, but, uh, it can be stressful. This game is just some needless fun. Alright, let's see if that Mahi Mahi left. But first, I'll grab these good guys. Yeah, once can, you guys can just skip all of me eating and get to the action at some point. Eventually, you'll, I'll do some action, but... If you guys don't like this part, some people like to see the journey, not just the ending. Actually, I encourage you guys to watch the journey. You know, the journey's half the fun. If this is the, if the journey's a little boring, then the journey's still boring. But it's still, what, the ending wouldn't have happened without the journey. And no, that might, might be still there. I'm just like, just now getting to the next size. And this is gonna be left because, you know, don't want to make this a video that's an eight-hour video. That would be terrifying. But those boss battle videos, this could be ended up being about eight hours. It's entirely possible.
Also, if you're confused and trying to play this game yourself, and you're, like, clicking survival, and, like, going in, it's, like, different, and you have, like, quests on the side of your screen, it's, this is actually deathmatch mode, when in reality, I think it's more survival, but, you know, whatever. I didn't make the game, I don't get to name it, but... That may be a bit of your confusion. And if the game isn't working for you, try turning off your Wi-Fi, like I'd have to do to play this game. It still works great, and you can still use recording software. Oh, by the way, I use a OBS Studio to record. It's free and works decently well. There's some good tutorials on how to use it, just I recommend the one. Thank you. I'm inking it. Oh, yes. The ink actually works. The ink actually worked. Did you guys see that? I used the ink and I started inking. And the guy just, like, turned away and stopped chasing me. That's so weird. It's also really good. Like, this area right here is super good. The problem is it's just so dangerous because of all these open spots that big fish can swim in and just devour everything over here. Oh, and if anyone's watching in Florida, is it true that you can just catch cuttlefish? Like, common, like, not super commonly, but you can just catch cuttlefish, like, on, like, in a river or something? You can, like, a canal, I've heard that you can catch cuttlefish. If that is true, that's crazy. And if it's not, well, I've been lied to. Uh, and also, I want to give back to who, uh, how I found this game. This guy named Blitz. He plays this game, tons of other games. Kind of like what I plan on doing. He was sort of my inspiration for this channel. He's real cool. His channel is just called Blitz. You know, really awesome guy. And he makes great content. Yeah, but like now playing this game, I realize how many hours he spends making his Feed and Grow Fish videos. But, uh, if you do go check him out, don't forget about me. You know, I still exist. Hold on. Yeah, but... Go... Show, show him some uh, love. Say thank you. My favorite YouTuber is just like you, and you, you're his inspiration. So, tell him that. And, uh, say now he's stealing all your views. <laughs> I would very much like it if you all just spam his comments and told him to play games with me. Would you guys like if I played a game with Blitz? I would love that. That would be so much fun. But, uh, it'll never happen if you guys don't help me out. He's not gonna want to play with people that have 10 subscribers. So, check. Have you subscribed? If you haven't, do it. Please. It helps. And also, you, it may not let you. That's because you don't have a. Watch me, don't touch me, don't touch me. Oh, well, this is the end of the video. Goodbye. I died to a crab. Well, these mahi mahis are the stupidest things ever. Oh my god, look at that. Health. 62 health. 4 damage. 1 damage. 1 damage. 3 damage. 1 damage. Oh, the Mahi Mahi is so strong. 
15 coins though. Oh god, how these things are gonna get expensive. How is the green moray compared to it? 31 health, 4 damage, okay. 38 health, 5 damage. Okay, so. I think the angler fish is probably better than the moray eel because. Yeah, it's a lot better. But the Mahi Mahi's health is just so much better than. It's better than everything until the ghost shark. It, like, what? The Mahi Mahi should not be there soon. It should be, like, over here. It should be, like, right. Like, it should be right before the. It should be right after the sailfish. And, uh. Obviously, if I beat the bosses, I'll go back and revisit, like, this creature, for example. The- I had to beat the Prognathodon, which is not easy. And then I get to defeat the Prognathodon, defeat the Great White Shark, defeat the Prognathodon, defeat the Megalodon. And on the river map, if I defeat the Arapaima, I can play as it, which I would love to do. But, um... I hope y'all enjoyed this video of me as a little tiny cuttlefish. And, um, uh, once again, I was a little bit disappointed by it. You know, it wasn't, it wasn't quite as good as I had hoped for. Like, the ink was cool, but, I don't know, I just didn't see it be doing very well. So I'll see you all uh, next time. This was episode four. I hope you enjoyed it. Goodbye.